This video is brought to you by Star Fox Zero, available April 22nd, only on Wii U. Game rated everyone 10 and up. We need your help immediately. We'll take the job. Andros won't be getting his way this time. Hey, what's up, guys? It's me, Brian Altano, with Per Schneider. Hey. And today we're playing Star Fox Zero, available on Wii U. Uh, it's a collaboration between Nintendo and Platinum. Uh, we've been doing Let's Plays for this game. Really fun, really awesome. But today we're going to try out something new. Uh, aside from co-op, we're trying Amiibo functionality, which is something very interesting in this game. Now, Star, Fo Star Fox has been around for a long time, since the early 90s. This is the retro R-Wing. So yep. to get that, you just scan your Fox Amiibo, and we get that very cool, very low-poly R-Wing. Takes me all the way back to 1993, which is, of course, when we played the first Star Fox. That's right. And a few years later, we got Star Fox 64, which uh, this game is sort of the first canonical sequel to or reimagining of or, you know, right back into that universe. So... Uh, let's jump into this stage. And so we're gonna do up. we're gonna do co-op. So you yep. gotta hit A on your controller too. You can play this with the uh, with the pro controller, but also you can use your Wii mode and nunchuck yeah. and everything. So we're gonna get our grief briefing here. Griefing. Mm -hmm. It's sort of a griefing. Yeah. It's a dog yelling at us. Always the dogs are always <laughs> telling us to do something, and we're like, we're gonna do it now. Good right, luck. So, by the way, this is it. it yes. Feels <laughs> yes. It feels like classic, like Star Fox or yeah. Star Fox sixty four. Um, you know, a lot of the levels are kind of throwbacks. You get like this big space battle, but the actual mission is different. And wow! Course, yeah. Look at these right. wings. <laughs> so the way we're gonna do this, I control the cockpit. Wow! Do you hear that? Yeah. Pew 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 pew. pew. All right. So your favorite quote. Yeah. There's too. our barrel rolls. Go barrel roll. So <laughs> now I'm con I'm controlling. Um, Sort of ship, ship. movement and uh, oh, get get that get that power up, speeding I want up, that. slowing down, Thank all that you. kind of stuff. You're actually controlling our bombs, but we're both shooting. I'm so not I'm not bombing anything right now. No, not yet. But I'm the yellow reticle. You're the green one. Yep. And I have no control over the ship. So if if anyone crashes into something, <laughs> it is Brian. It's my fault. It is Brian. So I got it. I got motion controls, of course, right? Uh -huh. So I am aiming by tilting the controller, which you're not doing. No, I'm, I'm pretty straightforward over here. We can take out these big frigates. Don't call them that. Well, wait, can I not lock in? Oh, I can't lock on because I've got classic controls here now. Yeah. Ah, this is, this is a, an extra little challenge. That's pretty cool. I thought it was just a ship that changed, but it's actually the way it feels is different, too. Yeah, we actually did some major damage to Peppy back there. Oh, by accident. oh, these guys, we got to take them out. Man, I really I'm love so that. I'm so used to locking on. I know, I love that laser noise. Can you shoot the guys on the left? I'll take the frigate. Oh! So you can, you know, depending on what's comfortable for you, if you're playing the gamepad, you can, of course, hold it up like this, too. You just push in the, the thumbstick. Do you want to see and, something? Uh, uh, and it resets it. You want to see something cool? Watch this. Wait, what are you going to do? Oh, come on! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, look at that little Andros face on the side over there. Yeah, that was cool. Oh, we've been slipped. Oh, uh, yeah. So these guys are a lot easier when you can actually lock on. Oh, man. They're yeah, a lot thanks, harder when you smash into them. Thanks for making me scan <laughs> Fox. <laughs> Evil people. So I'm saving my bombs for the boss fight. Good idea. Yeah. Also, I'm saving the bombs because I forgot which button to press. Oh, no, <laughs> it's a shoulder button. I think it's interesting that uh, Pepe used to say press Z or R twice, and, and now, now there's a ZR button. Yeah, <laughs> press ZR twice. Exactly. Things have changed so much. Oh, I forgot to shoot this frigate. There. <laughs> Don't forget to shoot the frigate. No, I, I thought it was a good frigate. Hold on. There we it's go. 90% of why I brought you along, Pear, is we're to doing, shoot the frigate. We're doing pretty well. Of course, you can compete for scores in this. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, man, you should have done a barrel run. There I was doing go. some stunts. Yeah, like getting hit by lasers. That's a stunt. That's a good trick. Made it look good. All right, shoot those things in the center. I need your help too. Yeah, well, I am. Look, I need your help, pair. If you know, have you noticed like things just blowing up yeah. around you? That's me. I thought that was just because no. they were bad at flying no. themselves. Look at that. Oh See, man, I'm taking. You're my wingman. You I'm are, taking you for granted. I'm, I'm your DAC, Luke. Uh, all this stuff <laughs> you can blow up. All, all right, right, here we go. Chicken walker. Oh my god, look wow, at the walker. Wow, retro chicken walker. Look at this little guy. Yep. In Super NES style here. I'm a low poly chicken. <laughs> Okay, so this is going to be harder because, again, I can't lock, and I am slave to your crazy driving. <laughs> <laughs> We're going for the oh, ring. Oh, there. Hold on. Hold on. I got it. I got it. Uh, Where are you shooting? Get the ring. Rings give you health, the of ring. course. Get the ring. Silver is good. Gold is better. Oh, come on. 
Where are you? Where are you aiming? I'm shooting the people in this. There's like uh, on the orbs on the ceiling. Oh, I'm not even. Stop seeing those. aiming at that guy. Where do you? <laughs> God, stop it! All right, check it. I'm, I'm saying okay. totally. Wait, still. there's one more. There's one more. Thank you. All right, was that it? Here, let's open that door. Watch out. There's motorcycles. Turn around. No, I'm gonna let that no? one go. All right, all right. So whatever you do, don't hit those uh, energy pillars. I'm doing awesome. Look you at that. Did. Look at yeah, that. Look that at was that. good. That was uh, that was much better than usual. Love it. Oh ah, ah oh, come on. I like how you make noises like you're actually getting hurt. Well, I am. Like the haptic feedback it, is it, so strong. It pains it's shaking me. Why well, it rumbles? <laughs> I have very delicate hands. <laughs> ow! See, we got hit again. You said ow again. Yeah, we got hit. There. All right, so you can hover with the uh, right stick. Uh huh. You can push the right stick down. You're doing wonderfully oh. fine. That was a bad guy. These little weird pinball parts. Yeah, aim up for a second. There you go. There's one more. Um, Don't worry about him. All right. So this is the uh, this is the Darth Maul tunnel. Okay. Go. Um, red is bad. Oh, red is bad. Oh, bad. Here we go. Okay. Very nicely done. Look at those little legs. Woo. Oh yeah. All right. So here, this is what we what this is what we preserved the bombs for, right? Nice. Oh my! You what? Oh, you I missed him. I missed. Yeah. Pear, are you kidding me? Short work. Yeah. I'm really glad you saved all those bombs. Yeah, I think it's a good strategy for the boss, especially when you don't have the lock-on laser. Yep. You know, just to, to be be able to just take him out super fast. Yeah, I think playing co-op together is a really interesting twist because I've been playing Star Fox pretty much most of my adult gaming life, uh, as you have. So it's kind of cool to see that throwback R-Wang. It brings me back a little bit. It's really cool. When you see it and, and when you hear the, the iconic kind of laser fire, it takes me right back, too. Yeah. And I remember booting up my Super NES with the, uh, you know, with the FX chip-enabled Star Fox card and just seeing the graphics, which look... I mean, they look silly yeah. by today's standards if you look at the R-Wing, but it was just so cool when you saw it for the first time. Yeah, I think it's really cool that they threw this in there as a little Easter egg for the uh, owners of the Fox Amiibo. So that was Star Fox Zero on Wii U. Uh, we're going to be doing lots of Let's Plays for this game right here at IGN. So for all things Star Fox Zero and Wii U, you're already in the right place, IGN.